A up me odes. It is Rowe here, um, and we're here with a pretty big release today. It, this came out two days ago. No, yesterday actually. This came out yesterday. I was hoping to get it up on the day, but uh, never got round to it. And this is Nerd Brewing uh, Emperor's Brewery, the 2022 version of Yoda Condition. This is an imperial stout with toasted coconut and maple syrup, coming in on a fantastic. 12.3%. So I am going to disappear for a second. Well, I'll obviously edit out. I'm not just going to just leave it here on a blank screen while I get this open because wax bottles can be my white whale at times. So we'll get this opened and then I'll tell you what, we'll get it bloody slurp, shall we? Yeah, cool. No worries. Be back in a second. I tell you what, credit where credit's due. The wax on top is actually so thin. I have just tried it with a bar blade. I haven't even had to cut into the wax apart from a tiny little groove there. And I can actually just take the lid off just using a uh, standard bar blade. So uh, yeah, so there we go. So that's the top off of this one. Obviously it's Nerd Brewing versus Emperor's. So we're gonna be using the old uh, Emperor's glass. Let's get this in. And the thing is like, there's no point me really talking too much about this one or saying what it tastes like or like pontificating about, you know, the nuances of flavor. They were all words there, weren't they? Cause it's Nerd versus Emperor's Brewing, isn't it? So you're gonna buy it anyway. So it really doesn't make a difference what my opinions on it are, because, you know, if you want this, you've probably already pre-ordered it. You've probably already got it in your stash or on the way to you. So let's just get it bloody. So I bought this version, I bought, sorry, I bought this can, bought this can, I bought this bottle from Junkyard in Nottingham. They had it on uh, keg as well as in bottles. I don't know if they still have any left, but, um, yeah, I'm looking forward to try this. I never got to try the original incarnation of Yoda Condition I th because, you know, um, sold out. But yeah, I, I was lucky enough to get a version, uh, uh, a bottle of this one. So jet black, head, uh, head no head retention, head uh, dissipate almost instantly. I've had a few rum and cokes. The head dissipates almost instantly. Uh, but yeah, let's get a little, uh, little uh, snifter there. Coconut, maple syrup. I don't know if this is... Uh, no, it doesn't say anything about it being bourbon barrel aged, but it definitely has like that uh, bourbon barrel aged smell, that like vanilla oak sort of uh, sense, but I'm not sure if it has been barrel aged. I assume it hasn't, otherwise it would have said on there. And uh, it's Emperor's Brewing. If it had been barrel aged, it would have been barrel aged in rum anyway. So uh, yeah, it smells bloody delicious. Um, let's get it bloody slurped, shall we? Or as someone made a reference, someone that said in the comments the other day, slurps up. That's badass. That is like the coolest thing ever. So yeah, slurps up, motherfuckers. Gonna slurp. Oh, there's so much coconut there. There's instantly so much toasted coconut. As soon as you sip it, you get all the roasted malts right at the very end. There's a lovely little bit of maple syrup coming through there and a little bit of sweetness. That's how, that's how you say it, isn't it? That, that's it. That's a universal sign for a little bit of maple syrup sweetness right there. Mm, that is. And, well, I mean, there's... Oh, and then look, right at the very end, just more toasted coconut. That's absolutely fantastic. Uh, I'm not going to do the usual. It doesn't taste like a 12.3% because you know you're having an imperial stout when you're having this. You know you're having a big beer. That is absolutely fantastic and well worth it for anybody who has, anyone who has a bottle, look forward to it. This is not one that you want to be aging. This is one that you want to be opening uh, as soon as you get it. Get this open, get it bloody slurped. That is absolutely fantastic. 60 IBUs as well. I mean, did anyone, does anyone care about IBUs anymore? Did anyone ever care about IBUs? Like the IBU arm race was an absolute waste of time, wasn't it? Like, no one, no one cares about them anymore. But for those who do care, this is 60 IBUs, so yeah. Yeah, absolutely delicious. So, oh, so good. So if you're in Nottingham, Junkyard still have it, but I can't imagine it will last that long. I assume it's in a, 20, a 10 to 20 litre keg. But yeah, that is absolutely marvellous. Um, yeah. So enjoy. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, as always, give me a like and a subscribe. It really means a lot. Uh, yeah, thank you so much. Uh, have yourselves a... Uh
bloody lovely night. And uh, yeah, I'll see you later. Yeah, in a bit. Yeah, bye, bye, bye. See you later. Bye.